that little pig. That'll do. Hello, knights, and welcome back to Holy Shit, I'm getting my ass kicked. Let's play. <laughs> well, I just got a couple of those guys. They keep coming up this fucking door. If I stand here, maybe they can't come out. Maybe this is how you do it. I do need to go get some ammo, though. These guys don't carry the same type of gun I have. Yeah, I think I gotta switch guns here. Oh, this thing does not look like it's gonna be super accurate. Oh, this gun is terrible. At least there's plenty of ammo for it. There's just no winning with these guys. Like, I, I don't know how I've, just, I've killed... I don't even know how many of them. They just keep coming out of that fucking door. Explosive skill went up. Might as well use it. Uh, I don't think that's going to hit them. Explosive ordinance has increased, and the force and damage delivered is now remarkable. It helps though. That means they can't take it away from us. Oh my God! Will you guys stop spawning? Oh, we almost didn't make it. Although. Okay, that was quite a while. Maybe, maybe we finally got them. That's, actually, you know what? I don't want to jinx it, but I'm thinking maybe those guys are finally gone. Now I just have to figure out how to kill all the rest of these guys. Oh, he took a beating. Wait, is this the kind of gun I had before? Yeah, it is. No, it's not, but it's better than that one I had. sure do like to push your luck. Oh, I'm out of grenades. Oh, which gun is worse? I don't even know. This one zooms in way faster. Until you try to start to shoot. Jesus. I think that little fucking... This thing over here might have been better. No, definitely not that. Let me do this, though. Oh yeah, that gun's way better. Okay, thanks for aiming in at him. <laughs> I fucking... There we go. And another one's gone, and another one's gone. Another one bites the dust. Do, do, do. Another one bites the dust. Oh yeah. I mean, it's getting them at least. There we go. Worked. Not great, but it worked. Yeah, I'll die eventually. Oh, I can't get him. See what it took a whole clip for me to realize that. That's okay. But grab some more down here. Because there's plenty to get. That's a little fucking mess. The janitor's gonna be cleaning up guns tonight. Do oil rigs have janitors? I don't know. They gotta have somebody who cleans up. Probably everybody pitches in, is my guess. Nicely done, agent. 
Thanks, Bella. I'm gonna fall off of this stupid thing. He's like running on. Oh my god. Right, no fucking. Forgot I didn't have any uh, grenades left. Um. Oh, I see. He's straight up. Okay, we are on the one oil rig. There's actually two of them here. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't just do that in the first place. You would aim at the barrel. That man would be on fire and you wouldn't have to worry. Which one's this one? Oh, a handgun? No thanks. It's probably more powerful than I have. Really no, hit him. Not you pricks. Saving ammo by like booting you in the face. MP50 is that one I didn't like. Oh. That could have been bad, maybe. Are these just workers? I'm just, they don't seem to be fighting back. But they got the bolt tag, so they're taking it. I don't give a shit. Oh, they got grenades. You guys know you work on an oil rig, right? Maybe grenades isn't the smartest option. Listen, Sergey. I'm sick of your bullshit. Okay. He's just going to spawn in. Oh, the door's closed. I think that means that no more guys come out of there now. Whoa. Where'd that come from? Seriously, where did that come from? Bob, maybe? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Stay on the thing. Don't fall. Oh, God. It's okay. We can get up here and then... Actually, get some ammo too. That worked out okay. You're fish food. I'm gonna throw this as the next guy. I see. Um. Okay. <laughs> I'll throw in the water then. Or him. I. It. He's dead. All of a sudden, he's not a person anymore. Oh damn it. I don't really know how to get up from here. I wonder if I gotta go back to that. Yeah, just go jump up. Oh, I can't jump up there. It's too high. Well, that looks lower. Well, I get there, though. Maybe if I jump off of this pipe. Oh, it's a little, got a little platform here. This must be the way. So then I can get onto those pipes. Here, I'll do it from over here though. Oh! I didn't even notice this was easier. Oh, look at that! Hidden orb. How good are we? Boom! Nice. Okay, now. Get up here, maybe we can go somewhere? Oh. Yeah, there we go. That's how you infiltrate an oil rig. Take tips, Greenpeace. Next time you need to go fly your freak flag. Greenpeace is one of those organizations where their heart's in the right place, but their methods are fucking ridiculous. I mean, good for them for trying to save the planet, but jeez. Climbing up an oil derrick and flying a flag literally does nothing for your cause. Like... I'm not one of those people who believes that any publicity is good publicity. Because I know I used to like Greenpeace because I thought they were good. Because, again, their heart's in the right place. But 
Then I see him pulling all this stupid shit that's actually like like illegal and getting arrested for it, just to try to spread a small message that like oil companies are evil. Like everyone knows oil companies are evil. You guys don't have to. Like, we know, okay? Like I used to work on the environmental side of oil. I know just how evil they are. But they're actually—it's they're doing a lot better. If we had uh, we'd do sites from like the '40s and stuff, and the shit that was on those sites, holy Christ! You get one from like anywhere in the 2000s, and it's a lot of times it's pretty much clean. Like unless they had an accident on site, you just go out there and plant grass, and you're good to go. Like is what. Well, what reclamationists do is, it's their job. We go in before. Um, you go in before the uh, the rigs drilled, if you can. Sometimes you can't because obviously those old sites, they never did stuff like this on because there was no regulation in the industry. But uh, oh, there it was. No, 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 no. Oh, good. Thought I was gonna fall all the way to the bottom again. But uh, you go in before and you check out all the vegetation. And then you go in after the rig's drilled, and you replant everything so that when you leave it, it's exactly the same, or close enough. Like, it's it's got to be really close to what it was. Why can't I get up here? Jesus. Uh, and then, yeah, so once it, that's done, then... Um, the site's back to what it was before there was ever a rig there. And if you do it good enough, you can't even tell where the rig ever was. But yeah, it's a lot of, a lot of. If it depends where you are too. Up north, they there's a lot of trees. That, I'm not trying to slam that guy or whatever was going on there. Um, there's a lot of trees and stuff, so you got to plant brush and everything. And, uh, he's not gonna make it. I'm not going to go for that right now. I was going to, then I decided that I'm not going to. Uh, there's my way across. The problem is the boss is over here. And look at all the dudes that are with him. Jesus. But yeah, so, I mean, the oil companies are better now with that. They've been forced to do that, though. It's not like they did that out of fucking the kindness of their hearts. Because I know in Canada, the government actually, if they have old leases on, like on record still, which they, they have to get signed off by someone in Reclamation, that it's passed and it's done its, you know, it's done its checks, every, all the checks have been done and everything. But uh, every month, I think it is, or maybe they just do it as a yearly thing. But they do get, it is a charge for shit. It is a charge per month as they have every lease, all the old leases. Whoa! I didn't see that coming. Fucking... Find cover. Okay. They do get, uh, they get charged every month for... Like, if they got 500 sites, they get charged for 500 sites that aren't done. So that's why they actually want Reclamation done as fast as possible now. But... Oh no! Those guys just beat me to death. Are you fucking kidding me? I couldn't. I couldn't fight them fast enough. Anyway, that's actually a good time to stop. But I never did make my point. It was just that uh, the oil industry is not as dirty as it used to be. Not even close. <laughs> it took a long way to get there. Oh, and also that Greenpeace—they have a great. I, they have a nice idea. But the way they bring shit around is just, it doesn't make sense to me. Like, there's better ways they could do it. Maybe they're less effective. Maybe they found over the years that, whatever, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't know. I was just talking out my ass. But anyway, I will see you in the next one, Nights, when hopefully we'll finally kill this guy. Have a good one. Hey, thanks for sticking around till the end. We appreciate you watching every one of our videos, and... If you want to get a hold of us outside of YouTube, all of our social media links are in the description below. 
If you want to become a knight, why don't you go ahead and click on that subscribe button. And as always, keep those shields up.